I started to look over the whole thing and it really it really made sense like the people just had enough of of injustice the president of Egypt at that time 2011 his name was uh, Muhammad Hussein Mubarak uh, he was uh, there for 30 years. The, the revolution uh, lasted in Egypt 18 days. It started uh, January to th uh, 25th, 2011, and it ended in February. The police failed after multiple attempts to make the protests go back, go away, arrested people, killed people, and then the army came in, and thank God the army didn't do what happened in Syria where the army stayed with the president and fought off the protesters. The army came in and just kept peace in the streets. After three days of the first day of protest, uh, I went out. I was uh, 13. My mom didn't want me to go out for obvious reasons. A person not so far away from me, like maybe like uh, 100 foot from uh, away from me and he um, he, uh, he fell down I didn't know that he got shot I hear gunshots and people started running and I saw him falling and then I ran back with my friends and then in the back I saw him again on the ground in a pool of blood he he died uh, he got shot square right here in the head um, um, I, 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 I've never seen someone die until then, and I was just terrified. I, I just went home. I came here January 2012, exactly a year after the revolution. My parents are happy, and my sister is making a future for herself here and getting engaged and just living life and at the same time while I'm making myself making a future for myself here I know over there in Egypt that they're making a better future for the country